Jared Sebo takes the spot back. Unbelievable battle moving to the back side now. Truly coming off of that wood section on the back side. Stuck his nose inside and got the spot, but only for about three seconds as Jared Sebo beat him to the next corner. Great Sebo, truly unbelievable. This one could be for the ages, guys. And now Sebo goes flipping, and Drake goes flipping, and Mike Truly is left out front. So now Truly out front. Drake falls to third. And Cody King in another MC9. Thanks now for that number one spot. His teammate, Jerry Sebo. Cody King moving through the wolf section now. Cody King, 40 car number four. Jerry Sebo, number one. I'll give you the separation as they come by the line. Moving on the front left side. And here we come. Mike Truly, 43-5. Cody King, 42-7. Adam Drake, 47-7. Ryan Mayfield, 44-1. Jared Seymour with that mistake. Drops to fifth to 49-5. Mike Truly, Cody King, Adam Drake, Mike Truly, 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 what is going to happen here as we close in on 143 drivers, 143 here. Forty-three thirty down, just 130 left. There is one minute and 30 seconds left. We started Wednesday morning. Well, we started looking forward to it way before that. And it came down to Wednesday morning. Everybody looked at the track for the first time. And an unbelievably sick layout laid down by Joey Christensen. It's ended up here in the last 115 with Tito and Mayfield with his side of each other on the front side here. Looks like Cody King going to have someone on you soon. Ryan Mayfield on your back door. And Cody King lets him by. Here we go. One and two. Tito and Mayfield. One mistake can make the difference here. Tito up front by less than a second, we'll say. Maybe about 1.2. Left side, 47, 46. Now we're up to 